Hi guys, Elite here and I have a fun quick layout for you and there it is. It was really fun to make and very quick uh, which is what I am loving these days. So the idea I had was we had this gorgeous pattern paper from Pink Paisley, the Celavi collection in the um, kit and it has all kinds of different colors in it, but this part that I cut out has uh, almost only the soft colors. And I don't know where this shape came from, I guess. I didn't really want a circle, but I wanted something uh, round and interesting. And yeah, I came up with this weird uh, shape and decided to use craft background. I really enjoy using craft. I think the um, um, cardstock kit that you can buy uh, additionally to the main kit, um, it always has white cardstock and craft. I'm pretty sure it always has two uh, craft cardstock sheets and in the last months I've been using them. Um, I think they look great with light colors and I think they look great with white. I've also been cutting them and just using them as layers, which is something that I really haven't done uh, before and is new for me kind of in the last few months. So, you know, you should try it. Try something new if it's uh, if you're not used to using uh, craft. So now I was looking for some embellishments and we got this really colorful uh, paper from uh, Amy Tan's new collection. Uh, better together I think it's called and it has lots of different colors and lots of different flowers. Now I personally find multicolored papers um, hard to use. It's just I don't know my layouts usually have two or three colors and it's usually a very I guess I use you know a lot of the same colors so it'll be like pink and peach or something like that and not pink and green and blue and yellow and everything. So what I did is I just cut out a few of the pink flowers from that colorful paper and you could you know choose whichever colors you like from that paper and cut out the flowers so you can use pattern papers like that also just cut what you like. And, um, and then I have a few embellishments and I can cut you know more if I need more um, and it's just paper so that's really nice. I love this fringe hearts from uh, the new Maggie Holmes collection. They are probably one of my favorite embellishments ever and I have used three on my layout so uh, they come four in a package so I have one more and they're actually also you know a great way to um, choose a color scheme. If you're not sure, you know, just pick which heart you want to use and then go to the papers and see what works with them. So there are so many different ways you can, um, you know, start a layout. And yeah, I backed my photo with a few pattern papers. I actually added a touch of um, kind of aqua, I would say behind my photo. I think it's the other side of this gorgeous, um, I don't know, chevron type paper from Pink Paisley. The other side is this really beautiful uh, stripe of, I think it's cream and aqua. You can see a piece of it uh, on the right bottom corner of the screen. So um, I wasn't sure what I want my title to be and I decided to use these cute uh, stickers that came in the Project Life Kit and these are also Maggie Holmes, also from the Bloom Collection and um, yeah, I didn't want to adhere them directly on my background uh, one, because I was scared and two, <laughs> uh, because I wanted to try this and I think it turned out really nice so I'm using a piece of vellum uh, which also came in the cardstock kit. I don't know if it's from February or from January. Uh, I'm not sure, but um, I decided just to add the stickers on that and then uh, cut it out. You could cut it, you know, 
a little nicer than I did. I just cut a rectangle uh, because I'm lazy and <laughs> you know you could cut around the letters and um, that looks really uh, cute too. But I just cut it like that <laughs> so it's really fast. And then that little um, sticker it has this really great uh, typewriter font um, and it says you make me so and then there's the happy so I'm just going to adhere those I thought about adding them on the photo that also looks really cute um, now that I look at it I kind of like it more <laughs> but <laughs> it's done so you see I'm just playing around that's another thing that is nice about um, adhering the stickers on vellum the stickers are clear the backing is clear so um, you know you still see uh, a bit of the pattern through the um, sorry the vellum sorry <laughs> about all the ums and ooms and whatever another reason I cut I adhered them on vellum is because then I can move it around and find the perfect uh, place for them on my layout now I'm looking to see if I like these flowers there and I end up using this cute little sticker this golden sticker I think it's like you know a little Bambi fawn or whatever these cute deers are called um, and I just wanted to bring a, an element in gold to that area of the layout because I have a gold um, sticker on the fringe heart and the fringe heart itself has some uh, glitter gold in it so I wanted that in another place and I'm looking for the best placement for the little flowers um, which I cut I had like a th three flowers cut before from the Amy Tan pattern paper you can see them on the left bottom corner of the screen but the three flowers didn't work so I cut uh, another two flowers the same um, like the two flowers that are on the fringe heart um, you know it's just little details but if something doesn't work then you know try to make it try to find a way to make it work which in this case was just to go back to the pattern paper and cut um, another uh, little flower so I'm adding a bit more gold behind the heart and that was a bit tricky to add um, this kind of round sticker but I did it I did it I conquered the sticker and I'm not going to add a lot more to this layout I really like how it turned out I'm not even sure I add anything more oh I know what I add I add a few of the um, oh I add the word love <laughs> it's also uh, from the Maggie Holmes uh, sticker sheet and I will add a couple of the wood veneer hearts from Studio Calico which I love and you know I can put them on every layout this package is huge and has a ton of hearts in it and arrows which are also great because you can you know direct the eye of the viewer to whatever part of the layout you want them to look at and that's it so I'm gonna show you um, oh right I thought about using one of these um, overlays from Amy Tangerine they also came in the kits I think in the embellishment kit and I'm not sure if I end up using them I think I don't on this layout I really like them and I'll definitely use them on future layouts so I kind of wish you see how the hearts actually work really well to the right side of my daughter in the photo there um, but because the the fringe heart is already glued on I can't really fit it there as well so it's gonna go back to my stash and yeah so what I want to show you is another layout I made with craft cardstock uh, from the kits which I really like and this one is uh, the one I made um, in this video and I added those little stars are from Heidi Swap and they are from a previous kit so thanks so much for watching have a lovely day bye